Hello, Success Academy Kindergartners. This is Mrs. Merrill, and we are going to be drawing this cute little ladybug today. The first thing I want you to do is make sure that you have your paper the right way. We want it going sideways, not up and down like this, but laying on its side like this. And the first thing we're going to do is draw our ladybug's eye. You can see that it's just a circle off to the side of our paper right here. Don't be scared to draw it nice and big. Okay, there's our first eye. The next eye is gonna come out from behind that eye, so it's gonna almost be like making the letter C. And there we go. If I'm going too fast for you, make sure that you pause the video, rewind it if you need to. I'm gonna go ahead and draw his pupils now. They're just ovals going up and down. And now let's give him a face. So from the bottom of this eye, I'm just gonna swoop around the bottom of the other eye. Here I go. And because he's so cute, I'm gonna color in his little pupils real quick. All right. And again, here's where we're at. Okay, the next thing I wanna do is another oval right here, only this oval is gonna be going sideways and it's gonna be his nose. Here I go. And of course we want a happy ladybug, so let's give him a nice big smile. Oh, look how cute he is. Okay, friends, we're gonna go ahead and draw the body now. I'm gonna start right up here at the top of his face, and I'm gonna do a nice big arch going all the way to the other side of the paper. Here I go. And then at the bottom of his face, I'm gonna draw a straighter line connecting to that last one. And let's give our ladybug four little legs. We're gonna do two in the front and two in the back. They're just straight lines down with a nice circle at the bottom. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And of course, we need some spots on our ladybug. Nice big circles. And then friends, the last thing we're gonna add are some antenna. They're gonna look like they're coming right out of the top of his eyes. I'm just gonna draw a straight line up and then a curly Q at the top. Here I go. And how about another one over here? The curly Q is going to go the other way on this one. Look how cute he is. And then friends, I want you to color your ladybug. Now, it doesn't matter what color you make yours. Just take your time. Make sure you do it as neatly as you can. And the last thing we're gonna do then is label the parts of our ladybug. So I want you to get some little strips of paper and write the word body. Body is spelled B-O-D-Y. And we're going to put that label right here on his body. I want you to get another piece of paper and write legs, legs, L-E-G-S, legs. And of course, we're going to put that one down here 
next to his legs. The next label is going to be a big word. This one is antenna. Antenna is spelled A T, I'm sorry, let me start that over A N T E N N A. Antenna. And we're going to lay that right up here next to his antenna. Let's go ahead and label his feet. Feet. F E E T. Feet. We're going to put a label on his head. H E A D. Head. I'll just put mine right there. And then of course his eyes, and eyes is spelled E-Y-E-S. And I'm gonna just put that right there. Once your ladybug is done, friends, take a picture of it and post it on your dojo for your teacher. Great job, everybody.